Geoffrey was a curious child who always had a million questions. Mummy, he called as he came down the stairs. Yes, Geoffrey, she smiled, putting the shopping away. How come in my books the stars are always so bright and big, but we can't see them like that at night time? Geoffrey asked. Well, it's because we live near the city, his mum explained. There's too much light from the houses that we can't see the stars sometimes. But why? Geoffrey asked. Because that's just how it works, his mum shrugged. Why is the grass green? he asked next. Because it's a plant, his mum sighed. Plants have special things in them called chloroplasts that make them green. Why is the sky blue? Geoffrey wondered. I don't know, Geoffrey, his mum said, annoyed. You can't know everything all at once. Sometimes you just need to learn things slowly. Geoffrey was not happy with that answer and huffed, going back upstairs to his bedroom. He flopped down onto the ground in front of his light-up globe. Edison, he whined, and the globe lit up. What's wrong, Geoffrey? Edison the globe smiled. Mummy doesn't want me to keep asking questions. I can't help it. I want to know everything. Geoffrey replied, annoyed. But Mummy says I can't know everything all at once. Your Mummy is right, Geoffrey, Edison laughed. If you knew everything all at once, it would be way too much stuff. It would give you a headache. Does that mean I won't get to learn more things? Geoffrey pouted. No, of course not. You'll learn more things, Edison explained. It's always good to be curious and ask questions. Sometimes, though, it's best to look at what is near you first. But there's nothing interesting near me, Geoffrey huffed. Do you know how everything stays on the ground? Edison asked with a smile, and Geoffrey shook his head. It's called gravity, Edison replied. It's almost like a magnet that holds things onto the ground so we don't float away into space. Do you know who discovered gravity? Geoffrey shook his head again. Was it you? Edison laughed. No, it was a man named Sir Isaac Newton. He discovered gravity while he was sitting under a tree. Geoffrey's eyes widened. Did he have a big scientific machine? He grinned eagerly. Nope, Edison replied. An apple hit him on the head. That's how he figured out that things always go to the ground. Well, that's so cool, Geoffrey beamed. I want to discover gravity too, Edison laughed at that. That's already been discovered, but the point is that you can find some truly amazing things in your backyard. <laughs>